Hey guys, so today I have a super neat budget friendly DIY for you all and it is wall tile scrabbles. I am so excited to make this because I just recently got that barn door, had to move some stuff around and this wall was looking pretty bare. And guys, this cost me all less than $20. So I'm just showing you guys quickly what I'm using. I got these wooden wall tiles from Amazon and they were $9.99 for a 40 pack, which isn't bad. But the funny thing is the day that this got delivered, I found almost very similar ones at Dollar Tree. I think it was like a four or six pack. They might've been like little DIY wooden coasters. But if you don't need a 40 pack, definitely go ahead and check out your local Dollar Tree. And then just some simple little stain and some foam brushes. But first off, I'm just gonna go ahead and stain all these pieces. I counted out how many of these that I needed to use for my wall tile scrabble. And I just wanted to say real quick, if you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Nicole from Stay Home with Natalie Nicole, and I do a ton of home decor hauls, decorating videos and DIYs, and kind of like refinishing and repurposing different kind of items that I find. And I would love it if you guys were to subscribe to me and give this video a big thumbs up and hit that notification bell so you know whenever I upload a new video. Now after the stain has dried, I am using the stick on letters that I got from Dollar Tree. I did think I got two or three packs of these. Obviously I didn't have to use all the letters, but guys, you can go ahead and freehand this. If you have a circuit maker, you can use your circuit maker to make it. I thought it was really neat to do it this way because honestly it was a lot easier than freehanding it. Now for my Scrabble tiles, I spelt out me, my husband's name, and our two dogs. And you guys can spell anything you want. You can have like little quotes that says love, live, laugh, family, and have your names. The ideas are endless for this. And then to make things a little easier to go ahead and attach these to my wall, I am using these picture mounting strips that I got from Dollar Tree. I think it was like a 10 or a 12 pack in them, which is a great deal for only a dollar because I've seen stuff like this very similar to the command strips at Walmart and they can be a little pricey. And I like doing it like this just because if I ever want to take them off the wall, it's not going to damage my wall and I won't have a million holes in there.
So now the fun part is putting them on your walls. Now I did freehand this, kind of eyeball this. I didn't make any measurements or use any tape. For some reason, the beginning of this clip was really, really blurry. So this was the only good part of this clip that I had recorded. But you can go ahead and use tape. You can measure it out. Like I said, I just kind of eyeballed it and I did use a leveler every once in a while. And then now I'm gonna go ahead and decorate around it with just pieces that I have laying around my home. So that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy this cute little budget friendly DIY. And if you guys are new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time.